How does self-exploration influence the understanding and improvement of female sexual life? Is it true that routine can negatively affect sex life? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Self-exploration can help women understand their preferences and needs, contributing to a more satisfying sexual life. It is true that routine can negatively affect sex life. Monotony and predictability can reduce desire and excitement in a relationship. Maintaining interest and emotional connection requires variation, creativity, and open communication about desires to counteract the negative effects of routine on intimacy and strengthen the bond between partners. Group sex fantasies. Group sex fantasies involve sexual encounters with multiple people at the same time, whether in threesomes, orgies, or gangbangs. These fantasies can be explored through imagination or consensually in real life. Hand fetishism involves sexual attraction towards hands, either admiring the aesthetic appearance of a partner's hands or engaging in erotic activities involving touch or manipulation of hands. Height disparities. Height differences between partners can influence which sexual positions are most comfortable and effective, with taller partners often needing to adjust their positioning to accommodate their shorter counterparts. Hormone release. During masturbation, a woman's body releases a series of hormones, including endorphins, dopamine, and oxytocin, which can improve mood and provide a sense of well-being. Impact on mental health. Individuals diagnosed with STDs may experience emotional stress, anxiety, depression, and feelings of shame or guilt, highlighting the importance of psychological support in managing these diseases. Impact on self-esteem. Anorgasmia can have a negative impact on self-esteem and self-confidence, especially if the individual feels embarrassed or guilty for not being able to achieve orgasm. Importance of foreplay. Foreplay, including kissing, caressing, and other forms of sexual stimulation before penetration, is crucial for increasing arousal and pleasure in both men and women. Importance of safe sex. Practicing safe sex including the use of condoms and other contraceptive methods, is essential for preventing unwanted pregnancies and sexually transmitted diseases. Increase in cases. Despite efforts in sexual education and prevention, STD cases are on the rise in many parts of the world, especially among young people. In some indigenous communities in Latin America, rituals and traditional ceremonies are practiced that include teachings about sexuality and reproduction as an integral part of culture and spirituality. Influence in modern literature. The Kama Sutra has influenced modern literature, with authors incorporating its ideas and concepts into novels and essays about sexuality and human relationships. Inspiration in film and television. The Kama Sutra has been depicted in numerous movies, television series, and plays, both as an object of academic study and as a source of entertainment and creative exploration. Internet popularity. Pornography is one of the most searched for and consumed content on the internet, representing a significant portion of web traffic worldwide. Kama Sutra in cinema. Movies and documentaries explore the theme of the Kama Sutra, offering visual representations of its teachings and its impact on different cultures and eras. Kegel exercises. Foreplay can include Kegel exercises, which strengthen the pelvic floor muscles and may increase sensitivity and orgasm intensity. Key communication. Open and honest communication is crucial in open relationships. Couples must establish clear boundaries, discuss their needs and concerns, and maintain constant communication for the relationship to function. Leather clothing fetishism. Leather clothing fetishism involves an attraction to clothing made of leather, such as tight pants, jackets, or boots. The smell, texture, and association with domination can be exciting aspects for those with this fetish. 
In the LGBTQ community, inclusive and affirmative sexual education is essential to address the specific needs of queer, transgender, and non-binary individuals, promoting acceptance and diversity in all sexual orientations and gender identities. Male and female orgasm. Although there are similarities in the physiology of orgasm between men and women, there are also significant differences, such as duration and intensity, as well as the ability to experience multiple orgasms, which vary from person to person. Masturbation and emotional well-being. Masturbation can help women feel more confident, better understand their bodies, and develop a more positive relationship with their sexuality, contributing to emotional well-being. Masturbation as a healthy practice. Masturbation is a normal and healthy sexual activity that can provide pleasure, relieve stress, and help people learn about their own bodies and sexual desires. Masturbation. During menstrual cycle, some women find that masturbation can alleviate symptoms of premenstrual syndrome, PMS, and menstrual cramps by releasing endorphins and reducing muscle tension. Media influence. The media, such as movies, TV shows, and erotic literature, can influence people's sexual fantasies by presenting scenarios and situations that spark imagination. In Latin American countries like Mexico and Argentina, fairs and community events on sexual and reproductive health are held, offering counseling services, HIV testing, and distribution of contraceptives free of charge. Mobile device consumption. With the proliferation of smartphones and tablets, more people are consuming pornography on mobile devices, making access and privacy easier. Multidisciplinary approach. Effective treatment of premature ejaculation often requires a multidisciplinary approach, including lifestyle changes, sexual therapy, medications, and stress management techniques. Myths about sexuality. There are many myths and misconceptions about sexuality that persist in society, such as the idea that masturbation is harmful or that virginity is related to moral purity, which can negatively affect attitudes and sexual behaviors. Non-genital foreplay. Foreplay doesn't have to focus exclusively on the genitals. Stimulating other erogenous zones of the body, such as the neck, breasts, thighs, and ears, can be equally pleasurable and exciting. Oils and lubricants. Using oils and lubricants during foreplay can not only make the experience smoother and more enjoyable, but also help prevent discomfort or pain during penetration. Onset age. Premature ejaculation typically begins in adolescence or early adulthood, but it can persist throughout life if not properly treated. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.